Are you ready to learn about the most fantastic, absolutely free AI tool that can make your Excel using days absolute breeze? Today, I'm going to introduce you to GPT-3 based formula editor that can edit and generate any Excel formula. Additionally, it can also explain whatever formula you have written. All you have to do is describe in plain English what you want to do and it will do it for you. Couldn't believe what you just heard? Well, let me show you. To get your hands on this tool, open Microsoft Excel, go to this insert tab, then in the add in section, click on get add-ins, search for AI formula, and click add written in front of AI aided formula editor. Agree to the conditions and click continue. Wait for a bit and it will be installed. If this AI aided formula editor doesn't open up automatically, you can click on this AI aided formula editor tab over here and then select AI aided formula editor button. You don't need any subscription. You don't need any API keys or anything else. That's it. You can right away use this editor. Now what this editor can do for you. The very first thing is right now this button has been selected which says cell formula. So it will show whatever formula a particular cell contains. For example, if I click over here and write a formula like sum A1 to let's suppose A50. So you can see that this formula is being shown over here. Not so great till now, but just wait what you can do with this thing. So whatever formula is written over here, it will be shown over here and if you click on this button which says click and see AI explanation in the console click on it wait for a bit then go to this console which is written underneath it click on this console and voila you can see that this tool has explained what this formula is doing so here's your formula and this formula will add up all the values in the cells a1 through a50 isn't that great let's try this thing with some other formulas as well so I've written a formula to average all the contents of A1 to A50 and then seal the result to the nearest integer. Let's see what this tool has to say about it. I'm going to select this thing. You can see that the formula is appearing over here and now click on this button. So this says that this formula will calculate the average of all numbers in the range of cells A1 through A50 and then round the result up to the nearest whole number. That's perfect. It's exactly what this thing is doing. Okay, so this was the easy thing which this formula editor was doing. Now let's get to the real part. That is the AI generator. What if you don't know what kind of formula you want or you don't want to insert the formula? All you can do is you can explain the formula in plain English and it will generate the formula for you. So click on this AI generator and now you will see two things open over here. You just have to click this uh, console once again so that it minimizes downwards. Over here you can see that there are two things. The lower portion is the same thing that shows the formula written in any cell. And now we have opened up this upper portion as well, which contains two further fields. In the first field, you can describe your formula. And then in the second field, it will give you the AI generated formula. You can close this lower thing by clicking on this cell formula just to clear up the things. Otherwise, I'll keep it open. So what formula do you want? Let me enter some things over here and then we can generate some formulas with it. So I've added some random numbers over here. I want this formula to, let's suppose, average the contents of cell A3, that is this cell, to A15, which is this last one. Round it up to the nearest integer and divide the result by three. That's it. So I want to average the th these things up, then round these up to the nearest integer and then divide the result by three. So let's see what this uh, AI generator has to give us. Now you have to click the submit button, wait a bit, and it will generate this formula. I don't know whether this formula is correct or not. Just copy this thing, click on any cell, paste this formula over here and hit enter. Great. It has done what we asked it. Firstly, it averaged out these ranges and then it divided the result by three. And at the end, it rounded up to the nearest integer. Okay, now let me do one more thing. I want it to put one if adjacent cell in column A has something in it. Otherwise, put zero. So I, what I want in this formula is I want to put one in some cell, for example, in the cell of column B, which can be this cell, if the adjacent cell in A has something in it. If it doesn't have anything, it should put a zero over here. So there is nothing over here. It should put a zero over here. Then for A3, it should put a one over here. 
And similarly, for A11, it should put a zero over here as well. So uh, let me submit this thing. Here's the formula that has been generated. I don't know what this formula is. I've never seen it, but just I'm going to copy it, paste it over here and hit enter. So it has given me a zero because there is nothing in cell A1 over here. So let me drag this formula downwards up till let's suppose this point. And that's really great. It has put zeros wherever this A column is empty and it has put one wherever there is something written in A. So let me write something over here as well. And it has updated the corresponding B column. So learners, the possibilities are infinite. You can generate any kind of formula, any complex formula. And even if you get some formula from anywhere, you can just select this cell formula over here and click on this explanation button. And it will explain that what formula is doing. I have never seen such a great tool for Microsoft Excel. This is really great. So I hope now you can use this tool and thank me later that I have introduced this thing to you. Thank you and take care.